Hi, this is Steve Knight and welcome to Blackwell Global's Daily Market Update. Starting with the Euro, and the pair managed to find some support around the 1 spot 1720 handle that allowed it to rotate back up to finish the day around 1 spot 1782. Much of the rise was due to a sense of general malaise around the US dollar that is, in part, a follow-on from a rise in wholesale inventories and lower bond yields. Moving forward, the market is likely to now focus on the Eurozone CPI estimate due out shortly and forecast at 1.6%. Turning to the cable now, and the pair initially spent most of the New York session trading right up to the 100 hour MA before backing off. Ultimately, price action closed the session out around the 1 spot 34, 37 mark, which is still just below the 100 hour moving average. This upward mobility largely managed to overcome a stronger US GDP result at 3.1% annualised. The coming day is setting up to be relatively busy for the cable as the UK GDP and current account figures are due out and likely to make their presence felt. Finally, turning to the dollar yen and the pair had a relatively negative session following a broadly negative swing against the greenback that saw the pair fall around 50 pips to close the day out at 112 spot 29. The Japanese large retail sales also added to the yen, buying coming in well above estimates at 0.6% month on month. Moving forward, the focus will now shift to the US Michigan consumer sentiment figures which are due out late in the coming session. Well that's all I've got for you today, this is Steve Knight with Blackwell Global, thanks for watching.